coding is a new language and every kid deserves to be fluent. I think coding is important for the youth because in this era that you are in now is a digital era. Scratch is something new and once they master it, you'll be able to be heard by the world. Africa Code Week is uh, basically a week uh, to celebrate uh, computer coding. And in 2016, we launched the program in 30 African countries. The program will benefit uh, children and youth aged 8 to 24 years old. So for the younger audience, it's all about digital literacy. Uh, last year, I was the ambassador of Africa Code Week in Egypt an amazing experience to see the children being introduced to coding. By learning coding, it has given me a global voice. You can do so much more with it. Honestly, it's like, it's more about your imagination because there's no limit to it, so you can do mostly whatever you want. So the moment I saw the kids, how they interacted with coding, I realized that this is something I need to be a part of, coming from Guguletu, there's a lot of kids who aren't used to computers. So knowing that we can actually give them an introduction to computers and showing them a different side to what they're used to, maybe the perspective of the world will open up. So I'm from the disadvantaged backgrounds or communities. The careers that are only exposed there is being a teacher or being a doctor or being a policeman. So ever since I started this initiative last year around September, now when you go to my village and you ask a kid what they want to do or what problem they want to solve in the future, they'll tell you about web development, they'll tell you about being an app developer. They are more exposed to technology now. Well, being an ambassador makes me feel very special because it shows what am I capable of. Scratch is not like a computer language to me. It's more like my diary. I get to do my own story. I have 10 girls in my neighborhood that I teach coding and I only have one laptop so I just teach them all just to understand the work. They do understand now that Scratch is a very interesting thing that they can ever do. So we had many um, moments of fulfillment. Uh, we went uh, um, to uh, Kigali uh, and also to the rural communities over there. And some of the kids had never seen a computer. It was once we asked them, how many of you guys ever used a computer? A show of hands. No one showed their hands. At the end of the lesson, then everybody lifted their hands. And yeah, what we told them to tell their parents is that I am a coder now. We were very uh, impressed and it was also very humbling to uh, uh, see the commitment of all the people involved. Africa Code Week uh, was born in uh, 2015. So what we wanted to, um, to do uh, for Africa Code Week 2016 is organizing the closing ceremony where it all took place, so in Cape Town. We thought that symbolically it was inspiring. The feeling that, I, that, that fills up my heart when I see kids smiling after coding, it shows me that we are in the right track of where we want to see ourselves in as the whole nation, as South Africa or as Africa as a whole. Now, if we're talking about sustainability of the program, so what is our vision for the next couple of years? Of course, we're going to expand Africa Code Week uh, to the entire African continent. And uh, hopefully we will get not only 300,000 kids engaged, but hopefully millions of kids engaged in the initiative.